There were rumors that Iran has supplied Russia with civilians and combat drones in recent three months. And I have made another video on this, but now United States has officially admitted that Iran is supplying Russia with advanced drones. Let's have a brief look to know what's happening. It may be a surprise for many who have not been monitoring Iran's shocking progress in making indigenous advanced weapons. But today, White House National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan said the information that US has suggests Iran was preparing to train Russian forces to use Iranian drones. He added that it was unclear whether Iran had delivered them yet, the Iranian side reacted with saying that cooperation with Russia in this field preceded the war in Ukraine. Actually, some accounts close to Iranian security organizations have long ago reported that Russia is already using Iranian drones in Ukraine war. And the interesting point is that if it's true and they have been using Iranian drones, then none of these UAVs have been hunted by Ukraine so that they could have any evidence. When I made another video about two months ago to compare Iranian and Turkish drones, which I believe two countries are considered to be powers in this sphere, many criticized and said that Iranian drones are not advanced and good enough to be compared with Turkish Bayraktar TB2, for example. Now let's face the fact that both of these drones are being used in Ukraine and it's surprisingly interesting that Bayraktar TB2 has been shot down many times but none of the Iranian flying machines, especially those kamikaze UAVs, have not been defeated by Ukraine which by the way uses advanced Western defense systems. Based on news from Iranian news atlas, Russian operators have already been trained to use Iranian drones in the battlefield. There are also other interesting reports that US has unofficially asked Iran to stop Tehran from supplying these machines because they know how much they could be effective in changing the course of the conflict. Now that Iran is almost totally disappointed to reach any deal, uh, with the United States in nuclear negotiations, they feel free to supply their ally with what they want. But their official stance with regard to Ukraine war is not to support Russia publicly, so they prefer to keep it silent. This is a big chance for them to field test their products against Western advanced systems and finally to make Russia supply those fifth generation advanced fighters, Sukhoi Su-30 and Sukhoi Su-35, which they have been waiting for so long. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and also to share your opinion with me in the comments.